everybody you're watching me Lenny Lynn and today I am going to be shampooing and deep conditioning my hair most likely because um, I do have a new conditioner a deep moisturizing conditioner I want to try here is my hair um it is like a week old and the rain the rain in New Orleans like it's been so nasty out here y'all like the weather has been so yucky to where my hair could not even you know survive it could not survive so I was like you know what I'm not about to try to keep stretching and stretching and stretching my hair being um with this naturally textured uh naturally straight I mean beautiful textures naturally straight box in my hair I was like I'm not about to keep on keeping it in my hair I might as well shampoo it and this is not a sponsored video by the way I am going to be using main selection now backstory now I was walking in my local beauty supply store of course you know there's one on every corner but I was like um hmm maybe I should try this 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 little shampoo and conditioner because it came in like a toupee and it was like three dollars so it was like buy the shampoo and conditioner for three dollars um when it's normally like six dollars I think it's like three dollars for each one and I was like why not I mean it's a new product so I was like hey I mean one more um I didn't really care for the ingredients I mean of course this is well honestly this is not all natural and the shampoo is what I really wanted to try because I do shampoo my hair weekly because I don't use all natural products so uh for right now I don't anyways now you get 12 fluid ounces which is like regular when it comes down to a shampoo you buy from the beauty supply store nowadays and you know, this is supposed to be a deep moisturizing conditioner. It's supposed to be extra moisturizing, again, for dry damaged hair, nourishes your cuticles, and it creates a luxurious, creates, creates luxurious shiny hair. That's what this is supposed to be for. Now, y'all probably want to know, so Lynn, what's the first ingredient, girl? So the first ingredient is distilled water. The second ingredient is sodium sulfate on the shampoo. The first ingredient on here is distilled water. The second ingredient is uh, soterial alcohol. And um, it got a lot of cones in this deep moisturizing conditioner. So <clears throat> I will be getting my hair prepped right now for the shampoo. And by prepping my hair, I'm gonna be using my Palmer's, Palmer's olive oil formula with vitamin E. This is a conditioning spray oil. This is a really good con uh, alternative for me for pre pre in my hair. And I did talk about this in a previous video. It has extra virgin olive oil and keratin proteins in here. It helps to condition this hair and scalp. It's sulfate and paraben free. Now what I do with my spray oil is I just go throughout my hair just randomly you know yay so I don't really concentrate it too much on my on my scalp because this is like one of my staples right now and I don't want to try to over oil my hair because I'm going to be breaking my hair down into some sections so you know y'all see that um I'm gonna also brush the back. Y'all hear how my ends are just like, wash me, Lynn, wash me. That's why my ends are screaming right now. And I'm like, all right, girls, I'm gonna cooperate with y'all. I'm not gonna put y'all up in another bun. So I'm gonna just break my hair down into two sections. Split those tools into another two. You heard me, yes. And I'm gonna grab my do grow. Uh, stimulating growth oil. I know y'all like, damn, all these products, girl. And I'm like, okay, well, I'm trying to show y'all how I'm going to get jiggy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm going to get jiggy, y'all. Um, and I just apply this to the scalp. And I do apply enough oil to my hair and to my hair and scalp because I feel like this is what actually gives me the best results when using any sulfate shampoos. I'm about to rinse my hair under some warm water. 
run my hair in the warm water, better words, man. And, <laughs> Lord, I can't find my thing. And after that, I'm going to come back to y'all and I'm gonna show y'all how the shampoo glides in my hair hopefully it glides and how it works in my hair like is it gonna help me revert am i gonna revert that's what we looking for today we looking for some type of revertage because i can't i, I really can't right now i can't with my hair y'all as far as i'm concerned like <clears throat> the box really does not revert your hair back in a heartbeat like it really don't I wasn't looking for that but I'm just letting y'all girls know like the first thing I felt once the water had hit my head was my roots revert and still in all my roots have not really reverted you, you, you still see some type of wave coming back but um for the most part my hair has not really reverted from water alone. Now, with this shampoo, I don't know what it's going to do. I really don't know. Here goes the moisturizing shampoo. I had to get in some better light and it was raining. So, like I told y'all, I had to, I was waiting. So, it comes out this nice teal, um, eastery blue, bluish green color. And it has like a um a slight lavender um you can step this oil, peppermint oil, whatever you want to call it, smell to it. As for the tangling so far, it's it really make it's making my hair soft, y'all. Look, oh, nice. That's a win win. And since I have this product, you know, the beautiful texture is naturally straight. Have to look back at it, y'all. Have to look back at it, yeah. Um, even, since I still do have the product box in my hair and it does not revert your hair right away I have to use a nice amount of shampoo for this first wash to reassure myself that I can at least bounce back somewhat and do a wash and go you heard me so I and it comes out nice and creamy it isn't really thin so it does have like a little weight to it so far, it really is making my hair soft. And that's no lie. And I'm just getting it now. Get to the front. Work it to the front. 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 And this video is not for the natural hair Nazis either. So I should have stated that before I started. Can't forget shampooing those edges. It's all in now, baby. It's all in. This is what the back look like. I hope y'all can see. So, I am reverting. Y'all see my texture? Um, I feel like the deep moisturizing conditioner wasn't really like a 
a deep conditioner it was more more so of a washout conditioner you know leave on your hair for a few minutes and yeah take me out because I don't want to be in but it didn't leave any type of a film on my hair uh, my hair does feel like it has been shampooed with a deep moisturizing shampoo more of anything I really don't care for the conditioner I really do love the shampoo I'll give the shampoo probably a 8 out of 10 um, I wish it had more um, oils in it if it had more oils in it I think it'll be a win-win probably like um, something else some type of oil in it and uh, as for the conditioner, I use quite a bit of it. Y'all can't even see through the bottle. I really like how it looks though. Um, as so for the conditioner, I feel like the conditioner needs some more um, work. It needs some more work, especially if you're going to be using it on like natural hair. Um, I really wouldn't recommend the conditioner to someone who is someone who doesn't like products that doesn't have all natural ingredients. I like it. It's okay. I could jig it. I could get jiggy with it. Um, the product line itself is probably better for weave and stuff like that. But the slippage on both of the products, awesome. Hands down. You have slip. You have glide. You know, you get that moisture when you apply it to the hair. That's it. I just wish it had more of the ingredients. A little bit more action pack for me and my hair. That's it. Other than that. Both of those products I will use again. They're win-win. I don't feel like I waste my three dollars. And you can pick up these products at your local beauty supply store. You're probably gonna have to look for it, but it's normally around the main Intel products in the beauty supply store. Well, at least that's where I found mine. But yes, they also have a de uh, um, detangler that comes with the. Uh, main selection uh, kit like there's a detangler that you can buy too but as of these products they are right they're not bummer they're not thumbs down they're just like some of you know it's ah uh, I don't know I'll give it another try so I like them I really do you know who would have thought I picked up something and I liked it you know who would have thought but yes, pretty packaging. Remind me of Mane and Tail. It has a little wheat protein in there, so that's the win-win. And I'm out of here, girls. Um, on a scale of 1 to 10, I give these a 7. I give these a 7. Not a 10. It needs a little bit more work. But for my hair, it didn't dry it out. My curls are still popping. It does have slippage and all that good stuff. So that's mainly what I look for when I'm using new products. And that is it. Again, at any local beauty supply store, look out for these products. You can also check out the link in the description box below. This is not a sponsored video. And it will take you to the website if you want to check it out and see what they got. Because the product line dropped last year. Yeah, 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 yes. So, I'm out of here. It's your girl, Lynn and Lynn. Feel free to comment in that comment box below. Thumbs up and subscribe, babies, because I do varieties of videos. Bye-bye. Yeah, I'm gone.